With the multinational inquiry already underway, this morning, the U.S. Coast Guard says it's convening a Marine Board of Investigation, its highest investigative body, to figure out what caused the deep sea disaster involving the Titanic touring submersible Titan. The board will first and primarily work to determine the cause of this marine casualty and the five associated deaths. It can make recommendations to the proper authorities to pursue civil or criminal sanctions as necessary. Authorities say they're reviewing data and voice recorders from the mothership, Polar Prince, which chartered the sub out to its launch point, and conducting interviews with crew members. Pelagic Research Services, who helped in the attempted rescue effort, sharing these images of its remotely operated vehicle, Odysseus, from a recent dive. The company calling the Titan recovery missions remarkably difficult and risky. Now, experts are focusing on the submersible's carbon fiber hull. Amid allegations that its owner, Stockton Rush, who was among the five killed in the underwater disaster, apparently ignored repeated warnings about the vessel. The company, which is closed indefinitely, says they have no additional information to share at this time. They didn't have any external uh, bodies, governmental, otherwise overseeing what they're doing. The mother of Suleiman Dawood, the teenager who died with his father, Shazada, in the Titan, opening up overnight, saying she was originally supposed to be in the sub instead of her son. It was supposed to be Shazada and I going down. Um, and but then I stepped back and gave the space to Suleiman because he really wanted to go. Christine Dawood also remembering her last moments with them. We just hugged and joked, actually, because... Shazana was so excited to go down. He was like a little child. Did I miss him? And I really, really miss him. And investigating officials say there were 41 people on board the support ship Polar Prince when it set sail on June 18th, including some family members of the victims like Christine Dawood, who you just heard from there. Interviews with those on board are already underway by authorities. The U.S. Coast Guard says a key goal of its investigation is making recommendations to improve safety on the water worldwide. Yeah, lots of eyes on this investigation. Anyway, Absolutely. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.